Good afternoon, guys, and happy Sunday to all of your sunshiny faces, guys. Look at this. There's balloons literally all over the place in here. Um, 141 to be exact. I think one is sort of deflating right now. Um, there was 144 and uh, lost three of them. Plus two, there's more in, in here too. Um, and today's my mom's birthday. That's why, guys. Look at we got balloons gigantic bouquet of balloons we got a bunch of flowers actually all over the place there's four different bunches of flowers everywhere um and then we got presents that we're actually going to take outside and bring out there jeff's already got a couple of them i think he just popped he either popped a balloon or dropped a present um and so we're going to bring these presents outside for my mom for her birthday so i don't know if she wants to be in the videos or not but i might wind up just recording her um the presents afterwards maybe i'll share with you guys um and then on top of that too we also had uh, breakfast matthew and jack ended up making french toast and scrambled eggs and also ended up um we had like some fruit and stuff like that and now we've got big top circus circus peanuts um animal crackers some m m's some colorful butter cookies and um, some red vines, like the big top, red top, sort of, I guess. Um, that's what I was going for, sort of a, a little theme there. Um, so anyways, like I said, we have to bring these presents all outside. Boys, what is that? Jack, you got popcorn. What is that? I'm surprised the puppy dog. Oh, it is popping out there. Freaking out about this. Oh my god, it's... Oh, there's a crew that came out through the one of the holes. <laughs> On the counter. Ooh, it's hot. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's really hot. It is about 11 o'clock. Um, if you guys saw popcorn maker that was one of the things we got my mom for her birthday that might have been a little bit to go with um part of my dad's father's day gift which we got him the new projector um and so we ended up getting my mom a popcorn maker so we can do outside movies or you know that kind of stuff um and inside movies too but regardless guys there was a huge spider I was sitting at, on my bed. I was actually trying to edit one vlog before I um, before I took a shower so that I could go to bed. I see this thing and it came crawling up right on my lap desk. It wasn't actually on my computer, but I was like, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I like got up, jumped up on the bed. I was already on the bed, but like jumped up, like standing up. I was like freaking out. Like the thing like ran right next to like my hand, like, and it was huge. It was like that stinking big guys. I mean, it was big for a spider. And I was like, oh my gosh, I have no clue where it went. All I know is it like, it was on my bed. Like that is scary. Um, I, like I said, it ran like down, like I think down my sheets and sort of like over into that crevice that way. Um, but I'm kind of terrified to go to bed. <laughs> it's like scary. I'm hoping I scared it off enough that it's not going to like come back on my bed and want to try and sleep in my bed with me <laughs> because I already have little guys that you guys can't see what are you doing back there are you hiding are you just as terrified you're like a stone you're like frozen like a statue right now you're so scared <laughs> he does not seem like he wants to move either you don't want to move did i scare you by jumping he's been sitting there since i jumped up out of the bed and um i think i might have scared him because now he's doing this awkward like i'm only gonna shake my tail two times kind of thing are you scared too i'm so sorry did i frighten you anyways guys yeah i was like scared too then i was like did he like climb up on me somewhere and, like i didn't realize it like it's on me um but no i've moved around a little bit it probably wouldn't be but that's just like oh it makes my skin crawl like i I seriously do not have that big of a problem with bugs like at all um 
as long as they're safe distance away from me. Like there's a little ladybug right now that somehow found its way in here. Actually, I'll be honest, there has been a ladybug that has been hanging out in my room for like a couple days now. And I was pretty sure it would have been dead by now. And I think that's the same one. Um, and I could, you know, try and like capture it and get rid of it. But um, it's like, uh, it'll be gone and then I'll see it again. And I was like, oh, that must be the same one then. Um, and here it is again. So, um, yeah, but that's what I saw and at first because they actually flew over there that's what I thought that spider was and I was like oh it's a little ladybug friend coming to say hi and I was like maybe I'll catch him then and put him outside and nope it was a spider and the spider had other plans and it was like bam flying away um that was just like absolutely disgustingly terrifying and if I was not so totally exhausted right now I would probably be ripping apart everything underneath my bed to try and find it because it was like a wolf spider it was big and i that that happened before too where there was one that it and it was like the same thing too guys like where it, but this one came from the other way so it was like right like over here and climbed up and i saw it. that one i think was bigger than the one that i just saw right now but it's still kind of scary especially when it's like on your bed um like that's terrifying <laughs> and scary so anyways though, um, yeah, besides that, my mom, we got her that popcorn maker for her birthday. We also got her some other stuff too, some clothes and some things that she wanted. But on top of that, guys, the other thing is that there's still all of these balloons. There were more. We popped a ton of them, but there's still a ton in the dogs. Look at, he's scared of balloons, so he's not trying to really get out. He also can't figure out actually how to get out. I'm not going to help make you a path, so you're either going to come, come with me or you're not. Now you're going to be stuck because you're only not going to be able to get out looking. It's, it's like filling back in behind me. Now he can't get through. Now he's stuck. You can go back in my bedroom. Bravo won't even attempt this. Like Charlie's a little bit not quite as scared. Go on. Go. No, 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 no. Go back in my room. He's not going to be happy that he's locked in there. <laughs> Like I said, there's still balloons on the floor for my mom's birthday present. Um, or not birthday present, from her birthday. Which seems like it was hours ago because I've been up for two days now at like 7 a.m. I think I woke up, I actually think I slept in today until 8 a.m. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I think you guys saw I we ended up getting my mom this popcorn maker and we ended up making this and then we also had popcorn for i was gonna say for dinner we had it with a movie um and we were watching once upon a time in hollywood which i'll be honest guys <laughs> was a very unique and interesting movie i am still actually trying to sort of wrap my brain around it just because it was a little bit like there were some parts in there where i was like oh this why was this even in the movie like it didn't even really have to be there and then there are other things where I was like oh this is kind of cool and then I was like okay it's kind of you know like unique story and then I was like okay like but again there just seemed like there was a lot that was like in it that I was like did this need to like be added in like I mean I guess part of it did but like me and my dad like my mom and Jack I guess loved the movie and then me and my dad were like it was good we really liked it but it just kind of left us like puzzled a little bit and kind of perplexed at the same time um so anyways yeah we ended up watching that and um we ended up getting actually olive garden for dinner tonight because it was closer um than we were gonna get texas roadhouse i think so yeah that was what we ended up doing but guys this was actually what i got my mom i got her a little it's actually a glass um uh like oil diffuser um it's actually this brand i got this um for her at actually at menards and i actually got it at a really good sale price too so i was like i'm gonna get that for her and it's nice glass it has a i think my reservoir for like the water has a lot more um like mine holds more um but i guess this can go for six hours continuously or 12 hours in 30 minute increments for 30 like every 30 minutes like i will do like 30 minutes on or not 30 i think it's 30 seconds on 30 seconds off um and like you know sort of just like a spurt 
for you know a couple of seconds or whatever i guess or something like that um that was one of the features like i said it has a um you have to like 12 hour intermittent so i think that's what it is 30 seconds of like you know puffing smoke and all that kind of stuff puffing the mist and then it will be off for another 30 seconds so um yeah that was the one i got her but like i said i think the reservoir for mine is bigger mine will run i think for 12 hours consistently one hour or six hours so i normally set it for mine for one hour right before i go to bed so it only goes for like about an hour while i'm you know falling asleep um and i think too kind of that lingering it helps me sort of stay asleep at the beginning um so yeah anyways we ended up um that's what i got her from menards but um then like i said we got a popcorn maker we got her a uh, like a portable speaker too she wanted that a couple of other things and then some clothes as well plus too the popcorn came with like all of the popcorn making stuff also um so like it came with like the popcorn kernels the butter it had like flavorings and stuff like that so anyways guys the kitchen is kind of a disaster too a little bit um but yeah we had a good time today it was nice but we didn't obviously get so much projects or anything like that for today because we were spending the day just kind of hanging out and everything but we got up early to do breakfast i think i was maybe telling you guys earlier um do breakfast and all that kind of stuff but again got up early so that we could wake up before she was awake and so now it's 11 o'clock i'm scared to go to bed because there's a spider somewhere in my room i need to go and take a shower and yeah <laughs> i'm also exhausted and yesterday was up early too so like i am pooped guys i am like done for the day so anyways guys as i try and get through the sea of balloons i will see you guys on tomorrow's vlog we're trying to keep the balloons corralled too because at one point they ended up throughout the entire house and um that was also a mess because then we couldn't walk anywhere at least in the hallway you know what you're getting into <laughs> so i'll see you guys all in tomorrow's vlog if you guys did enjoy today's make sure you guys give a big old thumbs up if you guys are new we'd love if you'd subscribe and i'll see all of your sunshine faces tomorrow so bye guys